Hey folks, Junkie Rod 13. Everything vaping related, it's Junkie Rod 13. Uh, my real name is Ross Sanders. And I'm here today bringing you another quick little review on the Clouds of Vapor tank filler. Um, it's a nice little nifty little device, uh, accessory I should say. Uh, very nice idea. Uh, we're going to take a look at that. And I have the contest results for the Vision, Bowie, uh, Wick, and Wire contest that I was doing. Sorry I didn't get this to you after the week was up, but um, I had a little family issue with my niece. Uh, and her house burned down, and we've been dealing with that all week long. But we're going to take a closer look at this, and at the end of this video, we will have the results to that contest. And um, for everyone that did not win or did not get a chance to enter into the contest, there's going to be another contest uh, probably this weekend. And um, I will be bringing that to you pretty soon. So let's take a closer look at this little tank filler and get to the results of that contest. Okay, folks, so here is the filling of a cardo tank with the tank filler. And this is just a basic, simple piece of Delrin with a slanted cut into it and a little groove and another little groove for another o ring. And what this is going to do now, there's no hole, so it's not going to be used as a drip tip, but it's going to be used in place of the drip tip to fill up the cardo tank. Now, you can use this on most cardamizer tanks that have this basic setup with a drip tip, cardamizer, and caps. End caps, I should say. I'm um, just going to take off the drip tip. Oop. Take the cardo filler. Tank filler, I should say. And we're going to push it down into that little groove lines up with that o-ring. Now sometimes I like to push it down a little bit further because some juice is thicker and it doesn't give it a big enough slot in there to fill the juice. So I'm going to push down a little extra and when it's, when it's up a little bit it has a tendency for the juice not to go down easy and it overflows. Now you can use the bottle or a syringe using this. And we're just going to squeeze some juice in there all the way up to the top. And there we go. Now we'll just take the cardamizer and push it right back up. Oh, let me grab a paper towel just so a little bit that comes out when I push it back up don't get all over the place now we'll take back off the tip wipe that off a little bit and put back on our drip tip so there we go very easy to use and we get a full tank this way. Now, most other methods of filling your tank with pushing the cardamizer down or taking off the top is seems to be very messy. This is not very hard to use. They're very inexpensive. Uh, I believe they're a few dollars over at Clouds of Vapor and they seem to work very well. So Let's go over and talk about it, and I will get to that contest drawing. Okay, so there you have it. The little tank filler over there at Clouds of Vapor. Um, like I said, these are very inexpensive. They're just a nice little accessory to maybe pick up and throw in your little vaping kit. If you are a tank user 
and you are having any issues with filling your tanks, I suggest these. These are very nice to use. Um, when I do fill these kind of th these type of tanks, I do use this, and it's very inexpensive. It goes right in a little drawer with the drip tips, and easy to use. I like the idea of filling my cartomizer tanks all the way up to the top. And when I'm pushing down the cartomizer and just trying to fill it, the tank with the cartomizer there and the drip tip missing, I can't fill it up all the way because then it can fill into the cartomizer. So this gives me a nice fill, full tank and looks nice and it lasts a little bit longer. Um, but, you know, check them out. I'll leave the link down below. And I'm going to get into the contest drawing. Now I'm just going to do a little, on, this, on the video, excuse me, on the computer screen and tape that of the drawing. And the winner of the contest, please contact me via email. My email address will be in the, um, down below, <laughs> excuse me and just get in contact with me and I'll ship that right out to you. And I will be having another contest very soon. Also, one last thing, um, I will be doing a show on Elixir TV this Saturday night, six to eight, gratefully, <laughs> wow, gratefully dedicated vaping with Junkie Rock. Um, I don't know what's wrong with me tonight, I can't speak, but, Check it out, uh, 6 o'clock to 8 Eastern. We'll have a good time. All right, let's get to that contest. Good luck to everybody that entered. All righty, folks, here goes the uh, random.org drawing for the cardamizers and the wick and uh, wire. Um, these are all the names that entered the contest. And the number one place when I hit randomize is going to be the winner of the contest. Here we go. And number one winner is Joshua Wolgam. <laughs> so he is the winner. Uh, please contact me and you and I will ship that out right away. Uh, thank you all for entering and good luck on the next contest.